We thought the raptor was alone at the top. We were wrong. Deep in the Russian steppe, a new predator is born. They watch from the sky, but they cannot see what is inside. Similar geometry, but the philosophy is completely different. Generative design. We let the AI grow the structure like a bone. It starts as dust, titanium powder, finer than desert sand. Fused by lasers, a single piece, lighter and stronger than any weld. Titanium 3D printing, they are reducing the weight to crazy levels. <sighs> Carbon fiber, the black fabric of modern warfare. Vacuum infused, not a single air bubble can remain. The spine of the dragon, rigid yet flexible. Welded in a vacuum, impurities are impossible. Masking protocols active. Close the roof. One massive composite skin. Fewer joints means fewer radar reflections. Robotic precision. Humans are too slow for this stage. The internal volume is massive bigger than the American counterpart. They designed it for long-range heavy killers, not just dogfighting. High-pressure hydraulics, the muscles under the skin. No hard angles. It flows like water. It is a lifting body. The S-duct hides the engine face from enemy radar. And for what the curve misses, these blockers catch the rest. Installing the IMA BK, the Integrated Modular Avionics. Their processing speed just jumped. That's a new processor architecture. Domestic silicon, immune to foreign backdoors. The N036 by Elka. Active electronically scanned array. We give the pilot peripheral vision. The Americans don't have this. The IRST. It hunts by heat, staying completely silent to radar. A single piece of glass coated in gold to deflect waves. The K-36. The pilot always survives. That is our promise. Even in the digital age, a 30 millimeter cannon settles arguments. Every seam sealed. The entire wing is a fuel tank. The Stage 2 engine, the heart of the beast. Serrated edges. They scatter the radar waves from behind. 3D thrust vectoring. Physics is just a suggestion. Fitting the power plant. Tolerances are less than a millimeter. That heat signature, it's hotter than we expected. More raw power. Stealth demands smoothness. A bump the size of a hair can betray you. 
digital camouflage designed to confuse optical sensors and the human eye. This paint eats radar waves. It turns observation into nothingness. Rugged gear. Built for rough runways, not just pristine air bases. System boot. The brain is awake. Sensor fusion. Hearing, seeing, and sensing as one. The Himalaya system. Electronic warfare integrated into the skin itself. The quiet room. Where we measure invisibility. Is it as stealthy as ours? Maybe not. But maybe it doesn't need to be. Out of the lab. Into the furnace. Achtubinsk, the hottest test range on Earth. The test pilot, a ghost in a machine. Telemetry link green, you are good to go. Brakes hold back 30 tons of thrust. Lit. A rocket with wings. He's climbing fast. Radar cross section is fluctuating. Super Cruise. Breaking the sound barrier without sweating fuel. The machine can take it. Can the pilot? <sighs> Controlled chaos. A flat spin that he can exit any time. Bay doors open. The claws come out. Aerodynamically, it's a masterpiece. I'll give them that. Friction heats the skin to 150 degrees. Hugging the terrain. Below the radar horizon. It thrives in the heat. It is ready for the world. Deep underground, where the teeth are sharpened. R-77M. Grid fins for instant maneuverability. No escape zone is expanded. Loading the internal bays. A puzzle of lethal geometry. It's not the dogfight I'm worried about. It's the range. They can shoot before we even see them. The R-37M. Designed to kill AWACS and tankers from 400 kilometers away. Hidden daggers in the armpits. For when the fight gets personal. Hypersonic. Speed is the new stealth. You cannot stop what you cannot catch. We have a hypersonic signature, Mach 10. Repeat, Mach 10. A carrier for the end of days. The hunter is never alone. Enter the Ochotnik. They share a brain. 
One pilot, two bodies. The loyal wingman. It takes the risks so the pilot doesn't have to. It's a force multiplier. One plane becomes a squadron. The AI sorts the targets. The pilot just pulls the trigger. Seamless handover from ground control to flight lead. The prototype phase is over. Now we build an army. 12, 14, 20. The numbers are going up. Automated stealth. Consistency is the key to invisibility. For our strategic partners, the Su-57E. Sovereignty in a box. If this tech spreads, the balance of power shifts overnight. The night is its natural habitat. Using the NVG feed, the stealth taxi is clearly visible. Despite the countermeasures, the thermal bloom from the fire and water. It doesn't need a clean nest. It fights from the mud. Western jets need climate control. Ours needs a wrench and a hammer. Airborne in 300 meters. Built not just to hide, but to find other ghosts. It's different. It's rougher. But in a knife fight, it's terrifying. It is not just a plane. It is a flying server with missiles. They rely on stealth. We rely on super maneuverability. We prefer to dictate the fight. The last human factor in the loop. At Mach 1.2, the pressure differential creates a singularity cone and a sonic boom capable of shaking the very ground we stand on. Shadows guarding the motherland. The assembly line never stops. The war of the future is data. From the desert to the ice. Global reach. Fox 3! At 1400 hours, the target was acquired and neutralized. Mission success confirmed. We need a bigger budget. The Su-57 Felon. Now you don't.
cockpit layout is designed for maximum efficiency. These MFDs process thousands of data points. The Radar Absorbent Material, or RAM coating, utilizes a complex micro-pyramidal structure, as you can see here. Designed for surgical precision, the Xylon Side Radar employs a multi-spectral scan. The M30 variant utilizes a proprietary helical rifling system capable of withstanding pressures exceeding 2 gigapascals. Designed for extreme atmospheric re-entry, the fin's composite structure can withstand temperatures exceeding 2,000 degrees Celsius. The intake grid must maintain a constant flow. Any fluctuation, even for a moment, risks catastrophic system failure. With the fly-by-wire system engaged, the pilot advances the thrust levers past the climb detent, committing the craft to its mission profile. This emblem, the Sukhoi Design Bureau's mark, represents decades of highly classified innovation and strategic air power.